if I come to the beach in the morning or in the afternoon before I come to the field and I do my running or do it, just even walk, and then I get in the water, body surf a couple waves, I feel like after that you can't say you had a bad day. So it's like, that, that's how I take care of my mind. I do a lot of work at the beach. A lot of my cardio stuff is at the beach. Um, I like to be barefoot and just get my feet in the sand. And leading up to a start, I, the days that I do start, I like to go on a walk with my wife. We'll go walk the beach and just talk and get like, it's good for my mind to ease it. And, and um, I end up going to the field like way more energized every single time. And there, there's a lot of work that I do at the beach that gets me ready. Uh, to pitch and, and perform. It's been a long time, a lot of experience and a lot of failure to get to where I'm at today. And I'm nowhere near having anything figured out, but I feel, you know, what, to be successful at this game is just being consistent. And so I feel like I'm getting more and more consistent. I would hope so after this is my eighth year. So, um, but I'm getting more and more consistent with what I like to do, with what I'm good at and having it show up on a, you know, daily basis. You know, they say 10 year starts, you're going to have nothing. 10 year starts, you're going to be, have a couple pitches and the other 10, you're going to have everything. Maybe not everything, but um, you'll feel pretty good. So I'm trying to make that about, you know, 15, five and, and, and five, you know? I know that's only 25, but we get 25 starts with a six man rotation because we got some stud named Shohei Otani in the rotation. Yeah, so if I could do that, then I think, you know, I'll be in a good spot. You pick up things, whether it's you know personality traits of like someone, you see someone be kind to someone else, you're like, man, I like, I like what I saw there and I, I need to pick that up. Or a certain pitch, it could be that, or a grip, you know, just, just different things. And like the way Noah gets after it when it comes to training and, and the discipline that he has, I, I like to consider myself the same. And it's almost like when, when I'm feeling like, I don't feel like doing that today and I see him doing it, I'm like, all right, I'm doing it. Whenever I feel off, when I try and slow it down, it kind of it feels like it's spiraling a little bit. So I just keep going and keep going. And, and the motto is like, I, I don't, for me, I don't try and pitch like a counter puncher. I try and go for the knockout. And so there's just different styles. And like, if I'm going to go down, I'm going to go down getting knocked out, not, um, you know, playing defense, if that makes sense. So I just keep going and, and yeah, you just got to keep moving forward and trusting it. So I throw a ton of different pitches and I've always thought that my pitch profile belongs in the rotation and I feel like I take care of myself well enough to stay healthy in, in the rotation and I just needed the opportunity to, to do that and so I was willing to pitch anywhere in the rotation. The fact that I had the Angels um, be a team that contacted my agent and said that they wanted to, to give me that opportunity that I've been looking for, it was a dream come true. I still wake up every morning and, I, and I'm, I'm here right now, I'm at the beach and um, I'm sleeping in my own bed and I'm seeing you know, my friends and I'm seeing my family. I have a bunch of ne nieces and nephews that are growing up and so to be around them and for them to come and, and watch some good baseball, watch the best players in the game and show hey, Trout, Rendon, it, it's awesome. Can't ask for anything more. Winning, I mean, that's it. That's the only expectation is winning and so. Um, to me, that don't, there's only one definition to winning, and that's winning. <laughs> so that's it, man. And, and you know, we're not. There isn't like a, a hope to win. You know, there's. We're going to win because you know we're good enough. <laughs> we're uh, we're exactly where we need to be. We have the guys to do it, so we just need to go out there and do it. And um, yeah, get after it. Just get after it. That's it. Hey, I'm Michael Lorenzen, and thanks for watching. Have you ever bad day?